Hey everyone, Eddie here at the PA Organic Garden. I just wanted to take a quick second and show y'all how I've been preparing for my fall garden. Uh, the tomatoes are all finishing up, Pep the peppers are all turning red, and everything's just been going good. So, come on and check it out. In this first box, you can see I have planted beside the asparagus. Uh, I just threw a bunch of seeds down here. Uh, there was lettuce, spinach, uh, arugula, Swiss chard. I think that's it. But you can see it all coming up. I'm going to have to thin it out. I just wanted to see what would pop up. Over here, where I had the pumpkins and cucumber plant, uh, and beside my ghost peppers, I have bush beans. And you can see my strawberry plants spreading like crazy too. So we got one, two, three, four bush bean plants, and then I'm um, pretty sure that's spinach. Uh, I forget what I put where, but yeah, I think that's spinach. Over here, off of my main garden bed, uh, right in front of where that row of sunflowers was, I actually cut a barrel into three pieces. I was going to make one tall vertical grow tower, and it was going to have these all around it so I could grow multiple plants and then you know one set of plants or one plant on top but I decided that it would actually be more beneficial to cut it into three pieces because now I can use the top of all three and uh, next season what I'm gonna do is actually plant flowers in these and if it, you know, grows up well, and then I have my other plants and they do well, then I'll actually uh, do the same thing to these. You can see I already have the holes drilled out. All I have to do is actually put a heat gun to it and then pry it with a board. And it'll just turn just like that. But if it doesn't work, then, you know, I only use the effort to do one barrel's worth. <laughs> You know, why do more than you have to? Uh, what I used to fill these was actually the compost that was in my potato box. Since, you know, only one plant actually grew potatoes, I figure it still has all kinds of good stuff in it. I also used a little bit of extra compost I had laying around uh, just to top it off. But, as you can tell, I laid, you know, just a sheet of cardboard down. And then I'm going to go and mulch over that as soon as I get some extra time to go out and get some mulch. Now over here, off of the main garden, uh, I have, this is where my corn was. What I did was put a layer of compost down and then I threw in, uh, that's broccoli there. I got one, two, three broccoli plants, but they're not doing too well. Um, I did the same thing there, though. I just threw a couple seeds into the ground. Well, that's about it for today. Uh, thanks for stopping by. Don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you all next time.